Hello my dear friends, welcome back to Infigia. In this video, we have another very very interesting question from algebra. Here we have to evaluate expression r plus s whole cube plus s plus t whole cube plus t plus r whole cube. If 8x cube plus 1001x plus 2008 equal to 0. This cubic equation whose roots are known to us r, s and t. Then we have to evaluate expression E. So let's get started by writing our cubic equation 8x cube. x square term is missing. So I will be writing coefficient as 0 times x square plus 1001x plus 2008 equal to 0. Now if I will compare this cubic equation with equation ax cube plus bx square plus cx plus d equal to 0 whose roots are same as r, s and t. So we can use Vita's method and write sum of roots r plus s plus t as per formula it is minus b over a. So here I will write minus of 0 over 8 value will be 0. So we have our first equation r plus s plus t equal to 0. Let me write here. This is our equation number 1. Now we will write product of roots r times s times t. This is equal to minus d over a. So as per our equation, I will write minus 2008, D is 2008, A is 8. So we will get R S T value. We will cancel 2008 with denominator 8. This will come out 251. So I can write R S T will be minus of 251. This would be our equation number. Two. Now I will simplify or evaluate our expression in two ways. So let me write here method 1. So I will write expression E which is written here. Now I will consider R plus S whole cube and then we have our first equation R plus S plus T equal to 0. So from here I can conclude that s plus t will be minus r and if I will write t plus r value then any time I can write minus s. From the same equation we can write these two equations. Now s plus t we are going to apply here. t plus r we are going to apply here. So I will write here r plus s whole cube plus s plus t will be minus r, t plus r will be minus s. So I will write minus r whole cube plus minus s whole cube. Now we will use a plus b whole cube formula here. So I can write e will be equal to r cube plus s cube plus 3 times rs times r plus s and then we will write minus of r cube minus of s cube plus r cube minus r cube plus s cube minus s cube will be over. We will get expression 3 rs times r plus s. Now from the same equation, the first one, equation number 1, I can write R plus S value will be minus T, which we will apply here. So I can write 3 times RS and R plus S is minus T. So this will come out minus of 3 RST. Now we will use equation number 2. 
let me write here e will be equal to minus 3 r s t equation 2 was r s t equal to minus 251 this was equation 2 which we are going to apply here so i can write expression value will be minus 3 times minus of 251 minus times minus becomes plus 3 times 251 753 our answer will become 753 now i will share method number 2 or approach number 2 this is our required expression e i will consider r plus s suppose this is a s plus t suppose this is b and t plus r suppose this is c now we will add these three equations so i will write here plus sign so i will be getting two times r so let me take two common in bracket we can write r plus s plus t will be equal to a plus b plus c now i can write here our required expression once we will assume this substitution so i can write e will be equal to a cube plus b cube plus c cube this expression value we are going to evaluate now r plus s plus t as per our equation number one will write zero so i can say a plus b plus c will be equal to zero once a plus b plus c is equal to zero we can use one algebraic identity a cube plus b cube plus c cube this will be equal to three times a b c so a cube plus b cube plus c cube is our required expression i will write e here three times a is r plus s b is s plus t c is t plus r let's plug in these values so i will write r plus s s plus t t plus r now we will use equation one once again in place of r plus s as we have r plus s plus t equal to zero let me write here this is equal to zero so from this equation i can write r plus s will be minus t s plus t will be minus r t plus r will be minus s now you can see we can easily write e will be equal to negative 3 times r s t let me write here e will be equal to minus 3 times r s t now we have equation 2 available so i can write here e will be minus 3 times r s t and equation 2 was r s t equal to minus 251 so i can write minus 3 times minus 251 minus times minus becomes plus 3 times 251 so we will get our final answer 753 using algebraic identities method i hope friends you will like this video Thank you so very much for watching. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye-bye till next video. Good luck. Take care. Bye-bye.